Hey everyone, it's me Val. Recently the announcement trailer for the game Indigo Park by the YouTuber Unique Geese and some of his friends uh, came out. Um, it's just a simple little announcement trailer that, you know, I, I just thought I'd do a simple analysis video on. Because, you know, point out certain things. So, um, here's everything interesting I found in the trailer. For starters, in the beginning of the trailer, we meet a raccoon character by the name of Rambly. Rambly claims to be the guide of the park. And he also mentions that how that Indigo Park, when it was running, was one of the most innovative and engaging family experiences ever. After Rambly says that, the screen starts to glitch as the silhouette of two ca other characters appear behind him. The character on the left appears to be some kind of bird while the character on the right appears to be some sort of snake, or most, more likely, a dragon, as the silhouette details fit more of that of a dragon. Once the glitching ends, Rambly mentions how we are the first guests in 2,920 days, 4 hours, 23 minutes, and 38 seconds. Just letting you know, that's nearly eight years of times since the last person stepped foot in Indigo Park. Something that I find very strange is that even though all that time has passed, the power is still on in Indigo Park, it seems. With the most obvious example being the TV screen that Rambly is on. But not only that, the fluorescent lights that appear as the camera zooms out and reveals a wide shot of the the decrepit old building that we find ourselves in. Something else of note is that as the camera zooms out, on the left hand side of the screen, we see a poster for something called Molly Macaw's Rooftop. Now, it's safe to say that most likely the identity of the bird silhouette from earlier is this Molly Macaw character. Something else that's interesting is, as we zoom out, even further on the left, there are two white glowing pinprick eyes. Now, to me, those eyes most likely belong to Molly Macaw, and I say this for something I will get into a bit later. Now, after we fully zoom out and it shows us the title screen, Rambly is rambling on. Say, I see what I did there? about getting Indigo Park back into business. But at the end, his voice gets very glitchy and distorted, and I think that's very interesting. But I'll get into my thoughts at the end of the video. Finally, for a second or two at the end of the trailer, at the very end, after the logo has faded out, we see a character shrouded in darkness with those same glowing pinprick eyes we saw earlier in the trailer. This character appears to be a bird, most likely meaning it's some twisted form of Molly Macaw. Because, well, there wasn't really any other bird characters we saw in this trailer, so most likely her. And that would also mean it was most likely her back in the earlier part of the trailer. So what does this exactly tell us about, you know, what the contents of the game are going to be like? Not much. It's just a simple little announcement trailer giving us a few little details about the lore and stuff. Now, I have, I have a few ideas of certain things that could happen in the game. Idea number one, Rambly will be an actual guide for us in the game, following us around on like various screens and monitors throughout the, throughout the park, showing us to little things that will help us on our journey. But something tells me that specifically the way his voice distorts at the end of the trailer makes me think that at a certain point, if he is our guide, he's going to get corrupted and become, you know, an evil freaking monster. Idea number two, Molly Macaw will be our first major enemy in the game. This would make sense for one major reason. It's that she keeps popping up throughout the trailer. First with that poster, then with that little thing of her hiding in the corner of the room. And finally with that final 
final little two second um, flicker of her face. So that most likely meaning she will be the major enemy of the first game, of the first little thing in the game. Now, for one final thing, the other silhouette, the dragon character, that character is, we don't know much about that character. It's just a simple silhouette and we'll, we'll learn, we'll most definitely learn about that character much, much later on. Um, besides that, that's really it. That's all I could really find in the trailer and, you know, um, I, I don't really know if I missed anything. If I did miss anything, uh, please let me know in the comments because I tend to miss stuff. And, like, even when I'm, like, looking over trailers and stuff, I, like, sometimes I'll go back and see something that I never noticed. So, if you know, if any of you notice anything that I missed in, you know, this analysis, um, let me know. Let me know in the comments. Um, but, yeah, with that being said, um, uh, I'd like to ask y'all to kindly subscribe if you can, and I apologize for being as awkward as I am, um, hopefully the, uh, editing will have cleaned up some of the awkwardness that I have, um, that I've had going on, um, but, yeah, um, that, that's really it. I hope you enjoyed the video, and, um, goodbye.